It's the perfect room quieter. Those, of course, are the iconic words delivered by the most electric artist from the electric company and the woman for whom we gather tonight to share in her glow. Damas and Caballeros, Rita Moreno. You know, really, I don't, I don't, I've said it all up there, but what a hell of a life, huh? The funny thing is that when, um, when Brent Miller came to me and said, would you you'd be interested in doing this? Uh, I said, uh, I don't know. I don't know if I want to entrust my life to someone. I don't know if I know you well enough. He was co-producing with uh, Norman Lear one day at a time. And it took almost a year, actually, uh, when I decided that maybe it was a good thing. And I decided it was a good thing because he reminded me that uh, I'd been through many, many things. I'd had many lives and that I had somehow come out uh, kind of healthy in a way. And that's really why I did it. I, I, I'll tell you this, there isn't anything in this documentary uh, there's no bullshit whatsoever. None, none, none. Uh, we just got voted a week as Critics' Choice uh, from the New York Times today. We've been premiering this, this show. We went to Puerto Rico a week ago. And, oh yes, I'll tell you one little anecdote. Uh, I took my, one of my grandsons, the one that was, I was talking to on the, on the set, and uh, he was, he'd never been there, and he was just astonished at the beauty of the island, but he was also uh, stunned at the, the, the greetings I kept getting from people in the public, and you know, Rita, and some people would start, really start crying. I mean, it's, it's me and Lin Manuel. And, uh, but my grandson was just stunned, Polax. And he said, I had no idea. I said, I've been telling you this for years. I'm a fucking star. 